Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can fade an image in Photopea. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now in Photopea and this is how the home page looks like. So right here in the left side of your screen, you're going to find the home section, this device, PR Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive and all of the sections. And right here in the center of your screen, you're going to find these three options, new project, open from computer and template. Go ahead and click on your project. Then once you click on your project, you're going to be right here in this window. So basically guys, once this window pop out, they will ask you right here to name your project. You can choose the name for your project. You can choose the width and the height of your image, also the DPI. And right here, as you can see guys, you can choose the size for your image. So for example, I'm going to go to screen and I'm going to choose this side. Right here, as you can see, guys, you're going to find some templates that you can use for your project. So right now I'm going to click on create. Once you create your projects, you're going to be right here. So basically, guys, the first thing that you need to do is add an image. So I'm going to go to file, go to open, and then I'm going to choose an image from my computer. For example, I'm adding this one. So basically guys, once you add your image right here, as you can see guys in the left, you're going to find all of the tools that you will need in order to customize your image. So basically guys, in order to fade your image, just search right here for the fade tool that you want. So as you can see guys right here, you're going to find the gradient tool that you can use to make your image gradient. You need to select a layer and then click on it and then you will be able to uh, use it right here also if you go to filter here as you can see guys you're gonna find a lot of tools that you can use right here as you can see guys you're gonna find the blur so if you click right here you're gonna be able to blur your image and once you finish just go ahead and click on file and make sure to save your image thank you guys for watching see you guys in the next video